Hi everyone, welcome. Thanks for joining in. One diamond from east and we have 13 points. We've got all those diamonds, so there's nothing we can do here. Uh, if I double, I'm saying I'm short in diamonds and length in the other suits, which is exactly the opposite of what I've got. And if I overcall one no trump, I need to be just a little bit stronger. Even if you're playing Akol, where you're opening one no trump is 12 to 14, a one no trump overcall is 15 to 17 or 15 to 18. So here I've just got a pass, which is fine because I don't mind defending one diamond should that happen, but it doesn't happen. Okay, so we're well and truly out of this. Uh, East, actually, I think I'm playing, yeah, set up my system to play standard today. So two no trumps from East there is uh, 12 to 14. Pass three hearts. So West has got probably five clubs and four hearts. If West had four hearts and four clubs, he would have both, he would have responded a heart. And if he had five hearts and four clubs, he would have responded a heart. So uh, five clubs and four hearts is the only thing that makes sense. And there we go. So what to lead? Well, I'm still going to lead a diamond, even though that's East suit, because I've got Queen Jack 10, 9, 7. That's quite reasonable here. Normally, we don't want to be leading a suit bid by the opposition, but here, Queen Jack 10, 9, 7 is certainly enough. So here we go, Queen of Diamonds. And I suspect, there we go, five, five clubs and four hearts, as we suspected. Oh, and East has played a diamond, so that's... Great, queen, three, four, king, and east has returned a diamond. So I guess east is a bit stuck. Maybe east is, um, you know, it's not a huge dummy. It's only 13 high card points. And remember, because I'm playing standard, that Tuna Trump rebid from east there is 12 to 14. So it seems like east is going to be in trouble on this hand. So he started with a four-card diamond suit, and North's pitched a spade. So what's East? Four diamonds, hey, I don't know, three spades, three hearts, four diamonds, three clubs, something like that. So my, this, well, this, this is not a pretty contract for Declarer. So we can win this, just take my diamonds. Uh, now, uh, that worried. I can't really play Ace King in another heart because that's going to set the hearts up. Uh, I might actually just play a spade here. Oh, ah, North. Oh. Ah. Maybe my fault. Maybe I, maybe I could have played a heart. Ah, rats. Actually, my mistake. I shouldn't have played the four of spades. I should have played the eight of spades back to tell North that I didn't have anything in the heart suit and in, in the spade suit. So, yeah, my mistake there. Okay, sorry, North. Notice what I did. I was going great. Played the diamonds, got in led the spade uh, because I didn't know where the Queen of Hearts, where the Queen of King of Spades was. But by leading the four, a low one, I'm suggesting to North that I've got an honour in the suit. So when North got in with a ten of clubs, he played a spade back. I should have played a high spade to say I didn't have anything in spades and then we would have been better off. So my mistake, sorry, North. Okay, uh, let's play hand two. Oops. And six and 11 high card points. Mm. Yes, another one I'm not really that keen on bidding on. Um, what about you guys? Sunil, Wendy, Kendra, Annette, Quinton, 
John Espy, Susan Marsha, and others. Easter Diamond. I'm not keen. Uh, I know we've got 11 high card points and we do have a five card suit, but it's not a good five card suit. Ace 10. I'd have to bid at the two level if I bid two clubs. So it's just not good. Pass. Uh, we don't want to be, when we bid, we really want to be betting because we want to play the hand and I just don't want to be playing this one and I see everybody's passing which is great pass 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 okay um all right well now we have to lead so I'm not leading a diamond that's east suit uh well I could lead anything here I'm not super keen on leading any suit in particular I don't really want to lead a club with the ace without having the king. Um, I could lead the king of spades and hope that north's got the ace and, and then get a diamond rough, but I'm probably going to make tricks with that diamond suit anyway. So I'm not super keen on the king of spades lead. I'm not super keen on a heart lead either. Um, I think I'm going to go for a... Uh, well, I've decided. What do you guys think? Sunil's going to lead the five of hearts. Yep, me too. I was going to, my choice too, Sunil. Five, two, ace, three. Ace of diamonds, goodness. Okay. Mm, what's going on here? All right, we'll play the king. Oops. What's happening here? We know East has got the King of Hearts because North won the Ace of Hearts on the first trick. If North had the Ace and King, he would have played the King on the first round. So what's going on here? I'm really not sure. I think I'll just play a spade and see what happens. Okay, well, East started with two spades by the looks. And the Jack of Spades is now... A winner, which is why North didn't play another spade. Um, all right, well, we win the Queen of Diamonds. I kind of, um, actually, what I might do, actually, I think I'm going to play a club now. Now, the reason I'm going to play a club is that if I play, some, this is my thinking. I can play a club. Now, if I play a small club, you know, maybe North's got the Queen of Clubs and Declare it doesn't know where the ace is. So I can make Declare a guess whether to play the king or the jack. Now, even if Declare a guess is right, he can't, or she, she over there, she can't play the jack of spades because if she does, I'm going to rough that jack of spades. So I'm going to, I sort of want to play a club now to take away, maybe take away an entry from um, the north hand, from the west hand, so that uh, Declare can't make that jack of spades ever. I wonder if I should play the ten of clubs here. Maybe. Is that right? Ten might be the right card here, actually. Ten. Yeah, let's try the ten. Okay, so not the end of the world because oh, that... Um, What's going on? So he started with four diamonds. So I'm still going to make my queen of. Yeah, I can still take that ace and, and take the queen of hearts. That's it. Okay, that's an interesting one to defend. I'm not near north, I think maybe. I'm not super keen on North's pass there, a diamond pass pass. I think North really can bid one spade there. I know North's spades aren't great, but one diamond pass pass, this is a balancing auction. North is balancing because he's the last one to bid. The bidding's going to die out if North passes, which it did. So North can be a bit more... Um, 
uh, adventurous and passing one diamond there with that um, hand really is a bit bit timid from north spades aren't great but he doesn't really want to defend one diamond there okay never mind that's all fine let's play hand three okay we're in the bidding action at last 16 high card points now for the Akol players you're going to open this one spade because you're too strong for a no trump um, for the standard players you've got a choice and I'm playing standard we could open a spade because I've got five of them but the other thing we can do is open a no trump because a no trump is 15 to 17. Now the problem with opening a spade on this hand is that my second bid could be a bit awkward so suppose I bid a spade and north bids two diamonds what am I going to do on the second round I'm a bit stuck for a for a second bid so here I'm just going to open a no trump now five three three two shape even with a five card major it's okay to open a no trump um it's you know i know in beginners classes when you're first learning especially for the old players you sort of don't do that you show that certainly show that five card major but uh, it's okay to open a no trump with a five three three two hand and for standard players it's easy choice Turn of trumps. All right, so North is inviting me to game. I've shown 15 to 17. North is saying, are you minimum or maximum? And clearly I'm maximum. I've got 16 and a five card spade suit. So that's maximum. I could bid three spades now, but I'm just going to bid three no trumps. The idea with when North, when we get invited to game, we, we pass if we're minimum we accept if we're maximum and if we're in the middle we still accept so we're only going to pass if we're minimum and and 16 is certainly not minimum oh look north had ooh, ooh. interesting well this look at this hand this is interesting so we we're in three no drums is fine now we missed our spade fit interestingly we would not have made four spades because we would have lost two diamonds and one spade and at least one heart so four spades is going down uh three no trumps is probably going down also because you know it's just going down so let's uh uh, let's just play space. Maybe the opposition will forget to take their diamond tricks. No, here we go. Man, yeah. So going down, but again, ooh, oh, well, I'm still going down. I am still going down because I've still got that heart to lose. But remember, we were going down in four spades anyway. We were still losing two diamonds and a spade and we would still have lost a heart at least one heart so um that's fine you know, nothing we can do wendy's saying why didn't north bid stame and north was four three 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 shape let's just have a look at north's hand in one second just if i guess the opposition might throw away all their parts i just don't just expect that will take down one so wendy's saying why didn't north bid stamen well north is four three 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 shape so from north's point of view even if we have a trump fit even if we have a spade fit there may be no advantage in playing in spades because north's hand is so balanced north can't rough anything um so uh north thinks why plan a major when i'm not going to get to rough anything because my hand is so balanced and in a way i mean north was kind of right in a, in a sense that because you know this hand is 
just as bad and no Trump says it is in spades. So um, I'm, I don't mind. It's just one of those hands, just one of those hands where we cannot make a game despite the fact that we, um, you know, we're, between the two hands, we're reasonably strong, but just no game makes. So say la vie. Quinton saying, do you need 10 or 11 for Stamen? Uh, yeah, remember, I'm playing standard, Quinton. So to bid Stamen, you need to have enough to invite a game. So if you're playing Akol you, and partner shows 12 to 14, then you'd normally need 11 to invite the game. Because I'm playing standard, my one note trump is 15 to 17. So North only needs about nine, maybe eight, but um, eight or nine. Uh, in this case. Yeah, there you go, Wendy. Eight, eight or nine for Stamen and Standard. But again, the reason North didn't bid Stamen here is he was just too balanced and didn't really see any advantage in playing in a suit contract. And he was quite right, despite the fact that we had a nine card spade fit. All right, one heart, two clubs, two diamonds. So this is just easy pass here, no, no fit. Um, this is a competitive auction for us. Everyone's in the bidding. We don't have a trump fit, so no trump fit. There's nothing to do for us. Four hearts. Okay, come on. That's fine. All right, so... From East point of view, the bidding's reasonable, I think. Um, you know, West has rebid his hearts. East has got King Doubleton of hearts. Nothing in the club suit. And the North bid two clubs. So East isn't terribly keen on bidding no trumps there. So reasonable bid from uh, East. And... Okay, Ace, Five, Nine, King, really? Really? Do North have eight clubs? <laughs> Three, four, five. Yeah, North had eight clubs. Wow. Ooh. All right. So what's happening here? Four, two. So West was seven hearts and one club. Okay, well, let's go here. Four, five, one, three. So West looks like it was something like seven hearts, uh, one club, three diamonds, and two spades. So uh, we just better grab our diamond tricks before they disappear on the spade suit, and that's it. That's all we get. So West, a little bit messed up here. West could have actually played Ace, King, Queen of Spades, throwing away one of his diamonds. But he decided to take the diamond finesse instead. Um, one heart, two clubs. So you can see De Clara could have played Ace, King, Queen of Spades, throwing away one of the diamonds. Uh, and he could still have got back to his hand and taken the diamond finesse later. So De Clara just got the order of play slightly wrong. So let's just go through. De Clara drew trumps and then played a diamond up to the Queen and King. Better way to play would have been draw trumps Play ace, king, queen of spades, throwing away a diamond. Then declarer can cross back to his hand with a club rough 
and finally play a diamond towards the king, hoping that the ace is on side. The ace wasn't on side, uh, but uh, um, there we go. So Neil's saying North should have been five or could have been five clubs, should have been five clubs. Well, you know, five clubs would have been two down. So then, you know, five clubs could have been a good sacrifice, minus 500. If we if North had been in five clubs, we would have lost five clubs doubled. We would have lost three spade tricks and the ace of diamonds. And it's a little lucky that the king's there. So on another hand, um, five clubs could have gone down three if East had had the king instead of West. So there... To be honest, I would have been five clubs with the North Hand, but it's a slightly lucky sacrifice. Anyway, as it happens, we did a bit better than sacrificing because the clearer messed up the play and we um, ended up, well, we didn't really defeat Four Hearts. Um, West defeated himself, really. <laughs> right, one spade. Uh, another one, 12 high card points. So again, we... Well, no, we just got to pass here. Um, it's 12 points. We could double. We we do have support for the ambered suits, four hearts, three diamonds, three clubs. But it's not a hand I really want to be competing on. North's already passed. I don't like the vulnerability, so I don't really want to be encouraging North to do anything here. So we just pass. And glad to be out of this one, and kind of super glad because had I doubled, all I'm doing is giving, uh, we would have just given information to declare, a, would have helped declare a play the hand. So um, happy to be defending. Now, what are we going to lead here? One spade, two hearts, two spades, three hearts. I'm a bit tempted to lead a spade. The reason is... Um, I don't really particularly want to lead a diamond or a club anyway. And I'm thinking, where is Declara's tricks going to come from? Okay, so imagine yourself in the east seat. And we don't know how east-west is going to play it, but a couple of ways that Declara might play it is draw trumps and set up a long suit. Well, that suit was probably the hearts, but we know that the hearts aren't breaking well for... Declarer. So the heart suit's not going to get set up. So where else might Declarer get Trump get tricks from? Well, maybe he can rough something in the dummy. So I'm just going to uh, I'm not saying this is right, but that's my thought process. Just going to try and prevent Declarer from roughing anything. And yeah, okay. So I'm happy enough with this um it, by at least we've stopped to clear a rough in clubs or whatever it might have been so we can play a club now good mm, okay so well so it turned out declare had doubled in queen of clubs so it looked like declare had six spades and two clubs Uh, where's the ten of clubs? I think North's probably got the ten of clubs, so I'm just going to throw the jack just in case I can get over to the north hand. King of spades. Don't think that's going to make much difference now. Well, there's no point in ducking here because we've either we. We've got the Ace of Hearts, and we've got the King of Diamonds, maybe. There's no point ducking because Declare has got no um, Declare has got no clubs left. So all we can do is see if we've got any diamonds to take, and we do. We do, and okay, that's all we get. 
So declare a was 6322 two shape um, or 6232 two shape. So my lead, um, it's, uh, I wouldn't say it was a successful lead, but it didn't really matter too much what I led. You know, declare it could have, no, that's okay. I'm happy enough with that. So declare it would have been hoping to set the heart suit up, but uh, when I'm in with the ace of Actually, I did, yeah, as it happens. No, 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 that, that's fine. That's fine. Sorry, I'm, I'm talking nonsense here. Happy enough with that. I think that was our, that was about all we were going to get on that hand. Um, yeah, so my spade lead, I was trying to prevent to clear a roughing something in the dummy. That was never going to happen. Uh, it turned out to be a kind of safe lead anyway. Club lead would have been good. Club lead would have been a good lead. And then, anyway, that's what it is. So let's play hand six. Oh, hang on, hang on. Just stretch. Oh. I played bridge uh, yesterday in a tournament. Um, it wasn't a very long tournament, just a just twice. I think it was 24 hands in the morning, 24 in the afternoon, and I really didn't play well. Um, I was a bit tired. I hadn't slept very well on whatever night it was, Saturday night. I was tired. Um, didn't have a good lunch, so I wasn't in good shape, and I didn't play very well in the afternoon session. So I really, I know I, I often talk about it, but gosh, I... I don't know about you guys, but I really notice it myself. Um, but if I don't look after myself, I just don't play well. So I've got to sleep. And at lunchtime, i got to eat properly and drink water, stretch. Otherwise, it's no good. Do you guys find that? Do you find you get tired, but if you look after yourself, you play better? I certainly do. I really notice it a lot. Okay, six, seven, eight, nine, ten high card points. So that is a pass. One spade pass, one no trump. And again, this is a pass, five, three, three, two shape. We just don't want to be playing these five, three, three, two hands. Now, I'm not crazy about defending a no trump. Um, but Wendy's asked a good question. What's the best brain food? Aha, hold that thought for a second, Wendy. We'll, I'll give you some thoughts at the end. One spade, one a trump, so that's a pass. Two clubs. West has got five spades and four clubs. Uh, East probably only has two spades, but uh, West is offering him a choice of suits, and East is saying that she... Rather play in spades than clubs. Four spades, okay, fine. Yeah, so East has got uh, three clubs and two spades. East has done well here with seven high card points, five spades and three clubs. East is okay to, East doesn't mind bidding again, going back to that five, two spade fit. Uh, gives West another chance to bid, which East doesn't, quite happy about so four jack what's going on here four jack i wonder who's got the two of diamonds i'm looking for the two of diamonds here i'm, I'm not going to find it immediately but i'd like to know who's got the. oh okay all right okay okay oh, i see so north letters from a five card diamond suit okay so West was void in diamonds and has now played a card to the jack. Oh, well. Wow. Let's grab this. Let's, let's try and get a club trick or two.
So we started with no diamonds, four clubs. Must be six spades and three hearts, I would have thought, or seven spades and two hearts. Okay, what are we doing here? So well, let's play diamond, doesn't matter what I play, I don't think. West has got uh yeah, I just play a diamond. It really doesn't matter. West has got uh, just spades left, maybe a club. So it doesn't cost me anything. King of spades. So West has got ace, jack of spades. We're going to get another spade trick. So to clear it is down one. I want to clear it three hearts, okay. Four hearts, oops, oops, to clear up. What are you doing there, West? Why, where, West should have been two hearts. So that was a mistake. Spade, oh, I see what's happened. Okay, all right. Yeah, the spade, uh, no trump, two clubs, two spades. Yes, yeah, somewhere along the line, West really need to mention that heart suit. So not... I can kind of understand the auction, a spade and no trump. East isn't strong enough to bid two hearts with only eight high card points. So reasonable for East to bid a no trump. West, two clubs. Okay, fine. East, I don't mind two spades. I guess East could have bid two hearts there, but I don't mind two spades either. Um and then West just bids game and spade. So somewhere along the line, someone needed to mention their heart. So I think maybe West could have bid three hearts after the two spade bid. And then North would have, uh, East, sorry. Imagine this auction. One spade, one no trump, two clubs, two spades, three hearts from West. You know, West has got to be five spades, four hearts, and four clubs for that auction. And that way, East and West would have found their uh, but there are other ways, other ways to bid it, but yeah. Um, yeah, I think West there needed to bid the hearts. Okay, just a quick couple of, what's the best brain food, says Wendy. Um, Terence, light lunch, eating too well makes me tired. Yep. Uh, single malt from San Il, okie dokie. <laughs> Uh, never heard of it. What's that? Arepa? Arepa? Something? Heather? Rain drink? Okay. Bananas? Everyone's got their ideas. Uh, one thing I've found i got to have is carbohydrates. Um, I, if I'm playing bridge, I have carbs in the morning with protein. At lunchtime, I've got to have carbs. If I don't have my carbohydrates, then I fall asleep. Now, you don't need to go crazy, but for me, just a slice of bread, one bit of nice bread, um, banana, but certainly some carbs. And I've heard people say, you know, carbs makes me sleepy. Well, yeah, you don't have to have a loaf of bread, but just a nice slice of brown bread, a few nuts, banana, lots of water, um, that sort of thing. But absolutely carbs. If I don't have carbs, I will fall asleep. If I have if I have an, the right amount of carbs, a slice of bread, um, that really helps me stay awake without getting too sleepy. Does that include cakes? Well, yeah, yeah, but yeah. Bit of bread, I think, is probably better. Boiled egg, yeah, boiled egg. Protein, carbs. Good carbs. Right, uh, pass, pass, pass. Um, let's pass. Actually, I talked to her. Um, I thought she's a dietitian. She tells I have to call her a dietitian, not a nutritionalist. But apparently, the word is dietitian. And I talked about playing bridge, what I normally had been doing. And she said, 
are you crazy? This is when I wasn't having carbs. She says, how can you possibly stay awake if you don't have some carbs? And I said, well, I can't stay awake. It's been a long tournament. And she said, well, eat some carbs. So I started eating carbs at lunchtime and in the morning. And now I can stay awake. Except on Sunday when I didn't have carbs for lunch and I didn't stay awake and played badly. Uh, okay, one diamond pass, one speed. That is a pass. One a trump. <laughs> okay, I like it. So West has, again, because I'm playing standard, West has shown that no trump bid on the second round from West is 12 to 14. Uh, the Akol players, West would have opened to no trump. So one no trump, six spades, fine. A little unlucky here for Declarer because I've got all those spades. So this might not go too well for Declarer, but that's fine. And I'm going to lead, I don't know, heart or a club. Not going to lead a spade. I'll just lead a club. Nine check. Sort of wish I'd lead a heart now. Okay, that's fine. Ace. King, what would what did East North play? Ace two five four, ace king. So Jack nine East has got left, so my spades aren't good enough. What a north throw? Sorry, two of hearts. I don't think. So Declare is going to get five spade tricks. Four club tricks, so that's nine. Ace hearts is ten. Uh, don't think there's much I can do here. I was a little bit tempted to play a club because I don't really want to give North a free club, a free, a free heart finesse. Um, because it's too late for us to get that heart suit. Unless North has got the king of hearts and the ace of diamonds. I think I'm just going to go quietly here and I, I'm just nervous about playing a heart. Clubs are no good to me. What are you doing to Clara? Okay, well, there we go. Well done, Declara. You there was um that was easy for her. Okay, Declara had uh, you know all we got is that spade trick, that's all we were ever going to get. So uh no good bidding, look at that bidding. Gosh, I really like it. You know, East is thinking. Why did East do that? Let's just have a look at the auction again. A diamond, a spade, and no trump, six spades. Simple. So why why did East just do that? Let's look at it from East's point of view. Uh, she had great hand. West had shown 12 to 14 points with at least two spades, or two or three spades. There's no point in checking for aces or doing anything from the East hand because she had three aces. It couldn't be missing two aces, had uh, first or second round control in all the suits, so there was no suit in which we could take two tricks straight away from East point of view. So she just did a nice, easy six spades. I, I really like it. Uh, it's tempting on these hands to get a bit lost in the auction and try all this sort of fancy stuff, but one diamond, one spade, one a trump, six spades. There's nothing wrong with that for an auction. So well done, Declara. Oh, Sunil's made a good comment here. That, uh, again, look at the auction. One diamond, one spade, one a trump, six spades. So West opened a diamond, and East had ace, queen, jack, six of diamonds. So that's going to be a great um, side suit for Declara. Actually, seven diamonds would have been a pretty good contract. 
But six spades is very uh, nice. Well done to East. Okay, uh, let's play hand eight, five, seven high card points, pass, one spade. Okay, well, here we go. This time I'm going to bid. My hand's not great, but nobody's vulnerable, and I hear I don't mind competing. I could, I've got a couple of choices here. I could bid, if anyone is into Michael's cubits, I could bid two spades, one spade, two spades, to show five hearts plus a five-card minor. But that would commit us to the three level, and my hand's not super good, so I'm just going to overcall two hearts. Um, it's, not great, and it's not a great hand, but five, five shape. I've got good shape. My hearts aren't super with only one honor, but I do have king, 10, 9, 8. So this hand's got some playability. Uh, yeah, if anyone wants to Michael's cubit on this hand, that's great, but I'm just going to bid a simple two hearts. Didn't get me very far, but that's fine. Marsh is agreeing with the carbs. Yeah. Uh, one spade, two hearts, three spades, four spades. What are we going to lead? Not going to lead a spade. Not super keen on leading a heart there. I think I'm just going to lead a club. I don't know. Yeah. Maybe the club was okay. I'm going to potentially set up a club trick for... It's kind of mixed feeling about the club lead. We've set up my queen of clubs, which is good but potentially we're also setting up a club trick for Declare with the Jack-10. Oh, that's good. Uh... I don't really want to lead a heart here because if East has got the ace of hearts, if I lead a heart, the clearer just puts the queen in and gets to throw away a heart. I don't really want to lead a club because I'm, all I'm doing is setting up the clubs for the clearer. So what's going on in the, what's going on? Do I set the clubs up or do I play a heart and hope North's got the ace of hearts? Well, How's the clearer playing this hand? It's got, you know, there's a danger that it, North, that the clearer doesn't have any clubs left. I don't want to play queen of clubs and find East roughs that club. So what's going on? East has started with five spades, maybe six spades. East didn't draw another round of trumps. So um, what was the option? Spade, three spades, four spades. North had the king of clubs. Uh, you know, maybe North was five. I just don't want to play a club. Oh. Now I'm going to play a club anyway. I just can't stand the thought of leading a heart away from my king. I'm going to feel really bad if North has got the ace of hearts, but... Okay, well, I'm just getting rid of the lead here. Here goes one of the hearts, but I'm hoping that... I'm hoping that um, North doesn't have the ace of hearts. Oh, phew, I think we're... I think we've done well. All right, good, 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 good. Well, we're okay. Okay, North had the King of Hearts as well. All right, good. So happy not to have, um, we did set up the 10 of clubs, but Declare couldn't avoid losing that heart sometime anyway. Uh, now, Declare could have done better here. Can you see how 
how could Declarer have got one more trick? So we ended up getting two diamond tricks and one heart and one club. A couple of things Declarer could have done. One, Declarer could have set up that club, jack of clubs, to throw away a diamond. The second thing Declarer could have done would be to set up the heart suit, lose a heart, and throw a diamond from the west hand. But um, a club, setting up a club, so uh, setting up a club would certainly have been better for Declarer. Now, it's kind of interesting one to play. On the club lead, um, Declarer can, let me just talk this through, see if you can follow along. Declarer could win the, so when club, 10, king, ace, at that point, Declarer needs to do two things, needs to finesse the speed and set up the club trick. But Declarer's got to finesse got to set up the club trick first because he's a bit short of entries. So Declarer immediately plays another club to set up that 10 of clubs. Then uh, when he gets the lead or when she gets the lead, she can cross to the ace of diamonds, play the club throwing away a diamond and then finesse the spades. Does that make sense? So it goes club, uh, club, king, ace, good. Now the clearer plays another club, which I win the queen, small club. Now the ten of clubs is set up, or the jack of clubs is set up as a winner. Doesn't matter what I do, the clearer can cross to the ace of diamonds, play the ten of clubs throwing away a diamond, and finesse the spades. So, interesting one. That's quite a neat one to... That's, Quite a good one to play. A little tricky, got to get the timing right east there, but um, can be done. Five, six, seven, eight, nine high card points. So, oh, this is close. Uh, sort of, we're over calling here. So, there's pros and cons about bidding here. It's not a great hand, our hearts sound great. But maybe we've got a heart fit. Maybe if I bid a heart, North can raise to two or three hearts and make things a bit awkward for Declarer. My suit isn't great. Uh, so, you know, pass is fine. If you want a bit of heart, that's fine as well, I guess, just in case we do want to compete. Um, either way, I could go either way. I am going to bid a heart. You know, maybe North can raise the hearts. I mean, it didn't do us any good. I mean, I would have liked North to, but actually, I might bid three hearts anyway. I'm going to bid three hearts anyway. This is a little, I, this is a bit rich, I know, but North's already passed. I've got nine high card points, so. Um, I don't think we haven't got enough for game, but I'm going to bid three hearts just to kind of muddy the waters a bit. I don't think I'm going to get doubled, but I'm just maybe pushing the boat out a little bit. But I like the vulnerability. I like the heart fit. I'm just going to do this just to... Whoops, now North's gone a bit four hearts. Mm. This might be okay. This, so why did North bid four hearts? Because I bid a pushy three hearts. So North thought I had a six card heart suit and he's got four. So he thought we had 10 hearts between the two hands. So that's why North bid four hearts. So fair enough, North. And since we're not going to game, why raise the hearts? I was just trying to make things a little bit more awkward for East and West, which I... Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. Now, East and West can probably make a bunch of, you know, five, six. You know, maybe East and West can make their three no Trump contract. I'm not going to be too badly off in four hearts. Probably too many. 
One diamond, one heart, one spade. Yeah, I think I'd probably too. I, I think probably I bid too much here. Sorry, North. Well, let's see. Uh, don't know. Uh, so we've still got a spade to lose. We've still got a club to lose. It's got one diamond to lose. So we're probably only going to be one off, which might not be terrible. Just need East to have the King of Diamonds. So we're one off, which is not too bad. So sorry, North. I don't know, this might be okay. What can the opposition make? Well, now ignore my score. What? Let's look and see what the opposition really could have made. Uh, maybe diamond, spade. Well, I guess they could have made five clubs. Five, six. They weren't going to make three no trumps. So, you know, maybe, maybe I'm kind of sort of, I'm not terribly upset about the hand. I know my score isn't terribly good with, with 32%, but the fact is that East and West could have made five clubs. They probably could have even made four spades. Um, they were trying to play in three no trumps, which wouldn't have been good, but I don't know what the auction would have been if I hadn't bid three hearts. It's, it, out of curiosity, let's just have a look. Pass, pass. Oh, hang on. No, sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh. Sorry, I'm, let's see what happened if I hadn't bid three hearts. I'm kind of hoping they would have bid um, three clubs, three hearts, three no trumps. Okay, three no trumps. All right, so three no trumps would have gone down. Okay, my bad. Oh, hang on, was that, did I? Oh, blast, I think I missed hand nine, blast. Okay, don't worry. Sorry, 10. We can recap, get that later. That's 12 high card points. So this is one diamond for me. And now what? So uh, here I'm going to double. Now this is this is a balancing double or a reopening double. It's not penalties. Doubles of low level contracts are for takeout. I don't want to defend one speed for sure. I just want North to do something. And North is three no trumps. All right, well, fine. North must have a bunch of space. <laughs> okay, well, oh dear. All right. Three, six, seven, eight. Uh, maybe defending one spade would have been better. That's funny. That's funny. <laughs> uh, all right, let's play spade. Uh, what have I got here? One that's two. Maybe I should. One, two, seven, eight, nine. Maybe I set the diamonds up. Yeah, let's try this. Let's. I'm just going to play some diamonds. Maybe I can get the diamonds going. Oof. Queen to eight. <clears throat> That's four. I can get two diamond tricks. C. 
six, two club tricks is eight. I'm getting close. Yeah, let's, let's just set up the diamonds here. Um, I lose a diamond. Now, I think what I want to do here is play, I'm going to try this, I'm going to play Jack, cash the diamond, cross to the club, play a heart, and we get a spade at the end. <laughs> How about that? Okay, so we kind of snuck through on the end there. Nor when I make that takeout double, reopening double, and West passes, North could, but North could pass there and we could defend one speed. North chose to bid three no trumps and we kind of snuck through a little lucky, interesting hand to play. Now, I think I missed hand nine, didn't I? Let me just check. No, I did play hand nine. Okay, so we, we've actually played them all. I thought I missed hand nine. Good one. Okay, uh, they were fun hands. Uh, not a terribly good score for me, I suspect, but um, story of my week. Uh, interesting hands to play and defend, so that was a lot of fun. Good conversation about the food. I really think it's important. It's worthwhile, if anyone's interested, I think bridge players tend not to be great about how they look after themselves. Do some, go look in Google or your favorite search engine and, and type in uh, 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 nutrition for chess players or what the good chess players eat. And you'll find that some of the best chess players have their own chef who feed them the right stuff or check out what poker players are eating. Now we think of poker as, you know, the cigar smoking, whiskey drinking, gun shooting. But the good poker players these days, uh, you know, they're serious. And there's all these conversations on the poker forums about whether it's better to eat pistachio nuts or um, Brazil nuts or whatever it is. It's, you know, nutrition is really a thing for these mind sports, chess, poker, bridge. So, you know, don't be... Um, it makes a difference. All right. Thank you, everybody. Uh, good fun. I'll look forward to seeing you next week. Good night.